Okay, so let's talk about Allen Bluff a little bit. There's Misho, but the bluff made of a bunch of different layers, Jackson Formation, Hawthorne, Chipola. I'm not gonna go all into that, but oldest at the bottom, newest at the top. Uh, at the very bottom, we got uh, mixed seashells. Works up to another dirt layer where there was palmettos, trees, and stuff like that, palm trees, and there's a lot of fossils of that down there. And then there was a big muddy bay again, and then we were back at deep water, and with the deep water, you see all the shells that are piled up here. So there's a distinct line running right here that goes up. Uh, all kind of stuff in that. Here's a rock that's forming. Set that down. Big clam shell. Oh, it broke. Uh, these little shells here are just beautiful. So all kinds of stuff in here, but you don't see any bones up above this. What you look for is this dividing layer right here. And anywhere you find it makes a big dip like that. That's like uh, when you're at the beach and you got those little ripples in the bottom. If you dig in those ripples, you'll find seashells and clams and stuff like that. So I think everything just kind of gets pulled up in there by the wave action. But if we dig right there, we start finding stuff in these little pockets. So I'll just hit that while I go. A lot of blue clay in here. And this is the same, uh, so like if you went over to Andalusia, point A dam, you dig it in the bank over there, you look for the same features to get the most shark's teeth out of it. But here we got a, looks like a rib bone right there off of an old dujong or sea cow. If I can get it out. Screwdriver works so much better. There we go. Yeah, stop right there. So here's part of your rib bone. I keep my balance. It's petrified, solid as a rock. And all about a Allen Bluff formation are always black like that, I guess because of the black soil. But there's your rib. So if you keep digging around in that spot, you'll find more bones and maybe a few little small shark's teeth. Not a whole lot of big shark's teeth up here. But most of them are megs. Meg teeth. And actually in the same spot, I found one that was about as big as my hand one time. My right, dog, don't push me over. Uh, but you can see all the seashells just littered out everywhere. Down at the bottom, there's a lot of big conch shells, or welts, down there. So that's Allen Bluff for you.